Domestic food price inflation remains high around the world. According to the World Bank, between February 2023 and May 2023, inflation rose more than 5% in 61.1% of low-income countries, 79.1% of lower-middle-income countries, and 70% of upper-middle-income countries, with many experiencing double-digit inflation. In addition, 78.9% of high-income countries are experiencing high food prices inflation. In real terms, food price inflation exceeded overall inflation in 79.8% of the 163 countries where data was available to the World Bank. In Ghana, inflation rose slightly for the second month running to 42.5% in June 2023 from 42.2% in May. The rise in inflation was largely driven by rising prices of food and beverages, which rose to 54.2% from 51.8% in May. On a visit to the Madina market, an onion trader, Fuseila Ahmed, said the prices of onions from countries such as Niger adds on to the price of the commodity when imported, which is also passed on to the customer. <laughs> According to Azumi Ibrahim, who trades in cereals, most commodities in the country are becoming more expensive as fertilizer prices have shot up, while tools and machinery to aid agriculture are mostly unavailable. And that bro, and that crowd, mom, maybe never mom over Mr. Twenty Two. Say, no, they say, Castle, no, I'm not more by yet to me, Chicago, near Chicago, and to a book of folk rotating things into a medrano. Not Buono as I can. Nay, I can't wait, dear, I can't wait. A trader insulted Tilapia, Madame Georgina Amwa said fisher folks complain about the high cost of nets to go fishing as well as the high cost of premixed fuel she says this has made the prices of fish quite expensive omo the petrol miss a premise and the koyi namuno na sisi anu premise in soon the hobium na omo kwa tonsua omo nya yansu ya ya ba ya kwa faba ya ntu minton inti ama bibia ya basa first new year ton 10 cd if you want to five cities, as when you see and cast a one point two. The situation is not all that gloomy as traders in tomatoes say the price of the commodity is gradually reducing. Equa Blessing and Abnata give reasons for this. They say they are not going to take a crown. They are going to take a first one. First one is going to take a first one. They are going to take a 40 million, 45. They say they are going to take a 40. Some traders and tubers at the market also hinted of a reduction in prices of the commodity as tubers such as yam and cassava will soon experience a glut when they are in season.